Hey y'all, let's go to Dollar Tree. Don't know how y'all are doing, but I hope it's well. I'm doing fine myself. Yes, sir. Thank you so much. Have a good day. All right. Let's get us a buggy. Okay, grab the buggy. I really like these because it has a purse hanger. Love that. All right, let's go. Ooh, getting some pansies out. Hello, pansies. Yep. That's almost all they have right now. Okay, I know I'm not doing an Easter egg hunt, but I still think these are adorable. I've not picked them up, but look at that. It's clear, it looks like a bunny, it's pink. They have the blue ones with it's just a the face. They have the, the chickies, look at the chickies. And then they have the carrots. I mean, these kind of make a good decoration if nothing else, right, if you don't really use them. I wonder if they have some dollar twenty-five. Do I want the chickies with the feet? Can I reach that? Eh, I'm a little short. Can I get it? Can I get it? Oh, hang on. I'm gonna have to do this the girl way, I think. Okay, so we'll take that one down. Whoop. To get this one down. Ready? And I was successful in grabbing them both. <laughs> That's my little short girl trick short girl trick and these are the ones that have the little wings see and feet on them as opposed to these that just have like a little rooster face and no wings or anything so but those would be good for decoration too and they have a nice little assortment of these the hot wheels monster trucks look at that now they're a dollar 25 a piece but those are stinking cute, right? Look at this one with the giant wheels on it. <laughs> They're definitely putting out their summer um, stuff around here. We don't, don't forget the hula hoops, guys. These make great little gifts for Easter or any time, and it's a good exercise toy for, Chris, uh, for Christmas, um, for summer. <laughs> and speaking of that, they have the uh, pickleball sets. You know, here you get the pat, the paddle and the ball for $1.25 and they have multiple colors red orange purple and blue um, and they just, I've seen them sell the balls separate in a pack as well and over here we got some boomerangs right for fun they're getting the wet stuff out the goggles swim goggles the little inflatable things here's sand excuse me sand toys here's the water ball sling shooter we've seen that and the splash catchers but I'm showing them again because I know we're all thinking about summer coming. They still have all their gardening supplies. They call it the spring fling. They got the kneeling pads for the gardeners. These are $1.25. Huh? Pretty, pretty foamy. I, yeah, I think they'd work fine. You got a navy, a, a, a neutral, and a teal green, a darker teal. Um, we have these little quark quirky garden signs the gnome looks like a bee he says be grateful busy bee then you have believe in yourself and be kind on there so there's a few different ones there's be cute as can be and it says be humble and be grateful and that's a little girl one and it's so cute and then we have those up there with the bells we got the thermometers we got this the flower seeds and I've shown all this but I'm showing it again because you know I did a little early and now it's really getting to be springtime we got the Job's houseplant food fertilizer spikes we have the hummingbird feeders and now we're getting out all the steaks for um, 4th of July it looks like yep the ready truck oh look at that little red truck he's cute we have a welcome friends with the colors on the bug car the hummingbirds and so on and so forth yep hummingbird feeders they got the pruners still the garden hooks and the gloves and then over here we have you know the rake you can put together so this would be a dollar 25 and then the top or the bottom part of the rake whether green or orange would also be a dollar 25 we have the gardening fence and then we have the trellises so we have the black one and the dark green one and then we have the plant hangers and these go in the ground pretty tall to hold stuff you can also hang your garden flag off of that as well and they have these series of five dollar um planters they're self-watering planters that's what makes them five dollars it's nice and big on the inside 
and see there's the side where you can water it or whatever and they come in the terracotta the gray and I think there's a blue it's kind of a bluish gray but it they're all here mm, they have some cute sunglass cases they have the blue the flower pattern and now we have cherries I really like that I think I have a lavender one but I really like that cherry one so can I swap it out would that be bad I mean I'm being it's at Savannah I don't know let's see what else we got over here some of the blind bags and stuff for the kiddos and lots of the cool little pins with the diamonds on the top they also have some fidget pins I bought some of these yep for my girl they look kind of like this when you open them up and you can like mess with them you know fidget in other words so this is one of their end caps it has all the decor on it for spring and I'm noticing something new look at this guy has a bird on the top for the stopper so if I pull it up careful and open it and I could put in there whatever my, my oil um, perfume I guess that's a big bottle for perfume but you could put in bath oil whatever and it has that nice little kind of glass bird on the top these are doll 25 this is a smoky color and we also have a green one look at that I have not seen these yet so it's quite interesting and look at these this was also caught my eye it looks like a flower and it's an iridescent I don't know if you could pick up all of that but it's clear crystal looking and um, I mean I guess you could use it for all kinds of things um, it's supposed to be an incense burner I would think yeah that's really lovely and I know it's not time yet but you could pick one of those up for Mother's Day and hold it aside or Father's Day then down here we have these little signs look like a church window and it has a metal applique that says welcome in the center or this one says family I don't see that two of those and they all say welcome or family but then we have this one it says our family gathers here it's not a metal applique it's just a sign in the middle it's gray and the sign is black and white it has a distressed look to it there's a white one and I think that one says welcome to our home and is a natural color it's just a wall decor but I think you could just stand it up if you wanted these are $1.25 and then we have this wood decor that says bless this house with the twine around it and it's $1.25 and it's in that distressed blue and of course we have decorative bottles these do not have a lid but look how nice they are we have this uh, darker pink I would say this one is green for sure purple for sure and blue for sure so those are new to me at this store and behind it we have some new little books inspirational journal this one says he is my God and I trust him Psalm 9 91 2 and this one says godliness guards the path of the blameless we've got those two and I was able to tease these out of the back. So there's actually four. This one says, listen to good advice if you want to live well. Proverbs 15, 31. And this one says, be still and know that I'm God. Psalms 46, 10. These are all inspirational notebooks. And there's four different ones if you want the collection. So I like them all. They're beautiful. Some, I like the color on the book better than the sentiment. But... I do like all the sentiments and all the colors. They still have the plastic Easter bunnies. These are great for putting fillers in and giving to somebody because they don't break, right? I mean, they do, but you would have to work really hard at it. So we have blue, um, I was trying to say lemon, yellow, pink, and uh, blue. That was purple, purple and blue. So the blue is this pink, yellow, and purple. And this is what they look on the inside you can put candy in here a toy socks uh, a brush makeup whatever you want they make a nice little gift um, and then of course they still have all their plastic containers look at the chicky <laughs> these pails and all of these are $1. twenty-five a piece so now I'm in the five dollar section and they still have plenty of Easter decor and Easter items look at the Easter eggs and the fake flowers that is really cute and of course this is five dollars and that's really adorable I don't know that I saw these giant five dollar frozen mini collectible blind balls but they're here and I might have missed them 
and I was thinking that I'd seen these, but this is something else in here. This is not Jurassic Park. These are Mickey for five. What else is in here? Here's another Mickey. Oh, they're in there. Something's in there. What in the world? That's a ball that's squished. I, I have no idea what that is. That needs to be removed. Let's see if there's anything else in there worth looking for. I don't know. I'm looking for the Jurassic stuff. Oh, there's some in there. They're on this side. Here they go. There you go. Jurassic Captives Hatchling Dino. And it hatches out to one of these guys. These are five dollars. They also have LOL blind balls for five dollars. I don't think I saw those before. But yep. They also have these blind Easter egg. They're called the Ultimate Surprise Egg. And they are five dollars. And it says, What will your what's your favorite find? Fave find. Crack open three friend trendy toys. I got purple, blue, and pink is what I can see, but it doesn't tell you what toys you might get. I think this might give us an indicator right in here of what you might get, but it's a surprise. Sometimes people ask me if Dollar Tree sells shoes, and the answer is occasionally they do. They have these canvas tennis shoes here in black and white for five dollars. They call them lady sneakers. They have some sandals here with a little bling on it. Five bucks. Ladies jelly sandals. And then check these blingy ones out. And they're calling this the ladies double band glider slide for five. The problem I have with Dollar Tree shoes is that they have limited sizes. So it is what it is. So Dollar Tree does sell the dupes of the Stanley Cups. This was called Aquaflow. It's $5. It is a stainless steel tumbler and it is insulated. It'll keep things hot or cold. And it has the straw and everything. It, it's lightweight though. This one is in white. I like the idea of that. You could decorate it if you wanted or you could just go minimalistic. One of the reasons I like to come to this Dollar Tree specifically is they have a lot of crafting supplies. I'm not a crafter, but I do do some crafts here and there, but I don't call myself a crafter per se. But, excuse me, I like to show you what is sold at some Dollar Trees so that maybe you can go look for it at your own or maybe you could even order it online because it's a product that they do carry sometimes, like that yarn knitting spool. I've never seen that anywhere else but this Dollar Tree specifically. So, and then they also have this guy. It's hidden with all the putbacks, but here is that little yarn um, container here. Keep your stuff straight. And what is this down here? Let's see if they got anything new. Disposable over sleeves. I've seen this elsewhere, but there's four pair in here so you can put it on so you don't get your um, clothes messed up while you're crafting. This is crafting square paper. I'll put that out there. I wanted to show you these bags. Um, this one's black and it has a zipper pouch and it has this long, long, long string for it. It's a canvas bag tote and there's one that's in neutral so you can get those and do them up however you would like. One of my other Dollar Trees I did find a whole bunch of jewelry making stuff so I wanted to see if they have it here. This is a mixing tool set. I don't think I've seen that. It's three dollars, uh, not three dollars, three pieces for a dollar twenty-five. Um, I'm not seeing the jewelry making stuff right now. I want to keep looking, but I got a, a little ways to go. But they have, you know, wood ornaments, wood pieces, chalkboard. I mean, they have everything. So um, here's all the galvanized appliques, metal. Here's the vinyl, and of course down here we have all the stickers. So we have a plethora of all of that. But no, I am not seeing the jewelry making stuff at this particular Dollar Tree, which surprises me. Because I was sure they would have it here. <laughs> so across from the big crafting section, I did find this um, set of highly fragrance incense sticks based on your um, zodiac sign. And so this one is Scorpio. So I have to grab that for my daughter. Well, I don't have to, but I'm going to. Um, let's see, do they have them all? There's Taurus, Gemini. Oh, don't break. The box is not real stable, so I'm a little worried about that. Okay, don't, nope. You need to go backwards. And now stand up right. Nope, they're gonna lean forward, but that's okay, they're not coming out. That's more Scorpio. Leo. I'm gonna stop looking because the box is gonna come on me and I don't want that. 
Oh, look at this. You have a set of two tea light holders in clear in those nice little squares for $1.25. That's crazy. And down here they have, I think I've showed these before, these um, filled glass votive candles. You got two in there, but this is glass. So when that one burns out, you just wash it and now, hey, you can go buy some new ones and refill it. I think that's an awesome thing to do and reuse. So I've not seen these candles with the little pom-poms on the top. But that's an interesting find. We have one that's white, one that's teal, one that's this really pretty red maroon color, and here's an orange. So I don't know if the pom-pom is supposed to signify anything or whatever. It smells okay. It smells like a candle. So hmm. Dollar Tree does carry um, some luminous fragrance oils or like essential oils. I've never tried them. I don't know how good they are, but they also sell the Aroma Guru Room Spray. This is True Lavender. This is not bad. And then they have the Room Mists and to each his own. Some of these smell good to me. Some of them don't. So I guess it's just going to depend on what you want. They also have this Aroma Guru Warming Oil as well. And I don't know if I've mentioned, but they do sell wax melts, a lot of different scents. I have not tried many of them. Um, this is the Luminous Fragrance Oil. This is Apple Cinnamon. Um, this one is Sandalwood. So they have some really nice, it sounds nice. I've not tried a lot of them. Sun Ripened Berry. And this is Fresh Linen and so forth. So they do have essential oils and wax melts as well as... Um, some um, diffusers, the reed diffusers here. This one is Balance in blue. They have, what is this one? Clarity in yellow. They have a green one that is supposed to be Tranquility. A purple one that is Balance. So they have the purple one, the yellow one, the green one. And that was the same one. I mentioned it twice. But anyway, so if you're into this stuff. And then they also have these Citronella candles. They're scented, and that is citronella, so you could put this outdoors or indoors to help keep the flies and different mosquitoes and stuff away. Um, this one is green, but there is a blue one, so I don't know if the smell is different. Oh, and I'm wrong. This is outdoor use only. Outdoor use only, guys. Oh, wow. I turned the corner and came over here, and look what jumped out at me. These stylus pens covered in fur. Is that not amazing? I know. I'm a sucker. I don't know how well they write or anything else, but yes, I'm going to grab one because it's happy. We need things to make ourselves feel good, especially when you sit at a desk all day and you just don't get to see outside sometimes. Oh, what is this? Trolls World Tour Stacked Pencils. Oh, interesting. This is $1.25. They do have, oh, look, I don't think I see this everywhere. These are the lead refills for mechanical pencils. I know I don't see these everywhere. I don't know if they're working every pencil, but you have to look at like this little measurement here to tell you whether they fit the pencil that you are trying to use with it. Hmm, I don't think I see these everywhere. We have some Minnie Mouse and Mickey Mouse um, eight color pen styles. Oh, and there's a different one behind it. What is that one? Let's take a look. That's a Trolls one. Oh, and there's another one behind that. Oh, Ego. Ego pen and Pop Tart pen. <laughs> and it's the multicolor pen. So we got Trolls, Ego, and Pop Tarts. Oh, did that come? Oh, it's got a little thing. And we have the Minnie Mouse and the Mickey Mouse as well. I was oh, I was wondering about Disney Princess, and there it is. We have a Disney Princess one as well. And it looks like oh, and up here we have Pringles, <laughs> red or green for the Pringles. Oh, and I knew we couldn't leave out Little Mermaid. I was wondering where Frozen is. I don't see one that's frozen, but if you look at your store, you might find one of those that is a frozen. We have some more pens that are from Jot that are these um, like fidget type pens. This one's a star and has the ombre colors in it, and purple, yellow, and orange. And this one's just blue and purple, but these are nice. Um, and there's one that's pink and blue. So we have a couple of different those. Those are just fun, you know, for the kiddos. I think these are a really good deal for your kids. These are great for Easter baskets, too. They're just a little dry erase board, but they come with the pen. And it has an eraser on the end. And it's $1.25. And this one is light blue. They have a green one, a purple one, 
and a pink one, a little reddish pink. And those are great for the kids in, um, like when you're traveling in the car or just to goof around at home. And even some schools require kids have dry erase boards now and use them. So grab them while you see them because they go quick when, you, when they're around. Okay, so I'm amazed at this. It almost fell off the shelf at me. This is a drawing pad. 30 sheets, 9 by 12s, and these are actually pretty nice, pretty thick. Um, so if you have an artist, it can be expensive paying for the paper. So Dollar Tree, Dollar and Quarter, they can make as many mistakes as they want, draw to their heart's content. And over here I found some new books. Look at this, Grumpy Cats, Grumpy America, a paper doll book. How many of y'all grew up with paper dolls? Wow. Oh, that is adorable. That might make a good Easter basket stuffer as well. I don't know if kids like paper books anymore or paper dolls, but they're definitely fun. I, I used to play with them when I was a kid sometimes. I mean, all right. And then the book section we have stocked up again. My Corner of the Ring. I think we've seen that. History class, a companion quiz book. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? That might be fun. You could make a game out of that with your kiddos. This is Olaf's Frozen Adventure. Um, this is a cookbook. Healthy cooking. Alright. I'm good with that. Um, the complete triathlons training manual. Jonathan Lethem. The Arrest. We have the master class here. I wonder why this book is so big and this one's so little. What is this one? It's paperback. That's all the only difference. Okay. Hello World. Tokyo, a book of senses. Huh? What is that? It's just a little... I can't open it. It's a car... Oh, it's a card book. Oh, it's talking about the different things you would find in Tokyo that would um, hit your senses, right? Stuck in the middle with you. A memoir of parenting the three gender... Or three genders. Um... A novel, Xander Miller. I think we've seen that one. Plains, USA. That's another little board book. Twas the Knits Before Christmas. Oh, so this is a book that tells you how to knit things for, to make Christmas items. Oh, look at that. <laughs> All right. That's for the craft, I suppose. That's kind of cool. Let's see what else we got. Oh, that's a crafting supply. It's a roller coat. It's in a room. Buy it. They haven't put it away yet. New York Lookbook, a gallery of street fashion. I think we've seen that. Um, Becoming Aware, Mindless Program by Daniel Siegel. You can only yell at me for one thing at a time. I bought this. I haven't read it yet. I need to. Oh, look, here's a Peter Rabbit book for Easter. Peter Rabbit 2, based on the major new movie. Um, Touched by Sun, Influence. Okay, what's this one? Neymar, Soccer Dream Come True. And then Paul Star on Beauty. Oh, that's a pretty thick book. Let's see what else is over here. We got some Jeepers Creepers. What is this one? Food Related Stories, Pocket Change Collection. Interesting. 101 Essential Tips for What? Home Brewing. Not gonna buy that. Some Hardy Board books. Mm hmm. All right. About the things that I purchased, but I ran across these again. This one says it's a, just a little zippy bag and it says duh on it. I'm gonna grab that because I haven't seen it in a while. They also have a whatever in purple. I'm gonna grab that. And then they have a hello in pink. What do I use those bags for? Everything you can imagine. They also have some other little bags. This is over here, kind of in the school supply section. And this is a catch all area, but. Sometimes I look in those because you never know what you're going to find. Okay, so I looked up on this end cap coming in front of me, and look what I found. Some new items. Beautiful new items. We have a pink woven basket, like the neutral ones we've been seeing. I like that. We have a gray one. And they even have a really pretty green one. Is that not adorable? And right above that, look at these ceramic birds. I have not seen these. This one is, oh, a neutral color, almost pink. This one is a bluish green, and this one is definitely lavender. So I'm going to grab each one of these. Hang on. 
so I showed you some Hot Wheels coming in but if you come back in the toy section they do have more and they really do have some interesting ones look at this this is a Monster High 2024 um, Hot Wheels car I have not seen that anywhere it has little spider webs on it um, this one says new for 2023 Ooh, look at the one behind it looks like an alligator Wow, oh. and and like a lot of these if you look at the back of them they show you like their collectibles and they tell you like what all the other ones are that go with it sometimes they don't but they definitely see that it says two of five that means there's you know a few more that go with that let's see what this one is this one says women's day 2024 best for track guaranteed for life look at that the purple and pink on it i wonder what the international women's day uh i might i don't know i'm gonna put those in the cart and think about them i think that's kind of cool i don't know that i've seen these anywhere i don't typically go through all of the hot wheels because there's so many of them look at that one that's a really cool dodge one right there but i do like to look sometimes and when something catches my eye i definitely am going to take a chance so look at that one look at this one kind of crazy kind of awesome that one <laughs> okay so they have squeezelings and they're collectibles so when you have peppa pig at this store i've seen the sonic elsewhere and this one is peppa the pig i love peppa it's such a wholesome show i do like it a lot and this has a uh, another blind bag in here but it is not peppa and there's some other things in here but they have a whole selection of these peppa squeezelings so my daughter was poking around over in the five dollar section and she found this jurassic park t-shirt that she's going to grab so my daughter convinced me to grab the little green trinket bowl oh look at this i have not seen this guy be kind or buzz off and it looks like a bee and it's a door hanger so you put it on your, your door i have to see what my daughter thinks of that this is sorry mermaids only dream in color that is really cute these would make nice things to put in an easter basket as well for your kiddos especially a tween you're always looking for stuff oh have i seen these little flakes these little metal leaves this one's gold there's silver and there's a red one back there maroonish blue brown maroonish brown so i'm not sure if i showed it in another video but they have the glass jewels here again honeymoon are there different ones they all say honeymoon on them that's really cool i wish i could do that kind of stuff that would be neat right and of course they have the lash glue and then all the Ioni different lashes. They have so many different ones. Ooh, and I went and bought gloves for my husband and I bought what they had because I knew Dollar Tree sold them, but they didn't have these. Look at this, premium safety gloves. So I'm gonna go ahead and spring. Now see, these are not premium safety. These say touch screen gloves. And the ones I bought said something else. I think they had some kind of special coating. But I like the idea that these are safety gloves. Look. So I was looking for a black pair. You know, because my husband's all that. You can see that's the touch screen ones. This one. Touch screen, touch screen. I don't want touch screen. Okay, so I guess I'm going to go with the blue pair. With the orange cuff. Because I like the idea of the safety on that. So I'm going to grab one of those. And in fact, I'm probably going to grab two of them because they are $1.25 and you can never have enough, you know, if you do work around the house and stuff, they're always great and handy to have available, right? Oh, there's the sunshades. They're jumping back out for summertime for sure. I was checking out, of course, the cat and the dog stuff and it looks pretty much the same, but I was considering switching up and giving my kitty some new treats. I just... I need to research this a little bit better. I want to make sure that this stuff is okay for them, just like it's okay for us, you know, to eat food. You know, I don't want to give them anything bad. Check out the bath bombs. I don't think I've seen Pez. Pez scented bath bombs. Strawberry. Oh, my goodness. Look what I just found. They're Smarties, and the Skittles were right up front at me. I did see that one, of course. Let's move it over because there's going to be a few of these, it looks like. Smarties, Skittles. Now look what I found. Hot tamales. Oh. Hot tamales. Blow pop. Are you stinking kidding me? $1.25 a piece. Those would be great in a Easter basket. And look, Disney Prince. I guess I cannot hold this in my hand. Disney Princess. LOL. 
Oh, I'm gonna have to move it. What is this guy? This one is just a color changing one, ocean breeze scented. Let's see, let's put it back. And then we got, yes, there's the Mickey. Oh, we still got something else. What is that one? Is it like a Jurassic? Like a, it's, it's not a, Jurassic Park, but it's a, it's a dino. Okay, and then let's see, let's move that one up there. Let's see, there's more back there. What are all of these? That is so crazy. Oh, and there's the LOL again. You want an LOL bath bomb, Casey? No. <laughs> Why not? There's we'll put them back in there. Yeah, no, isn't that crazy? I, I hope it, nobody tries to eat those. Let's put these all back in place. But that was a nice little find, now wasn't it? I have not seen those anywhere. Ooh, look what I found. I think this is a good find, too, because it has a lid. It's a collapsible storage container, but it closes. The top closes. Wow, I kind of like the idea of that. I can think of them. Wait, that's neat. And they have a whole bunch of them. They're all in that navy color, but how nice. Perfect for organizing books, toys, clothing, and more. Hmm, is that for you? <laughs> I don't think I've seen this Per Cara Baby Shampoo, Gentle Cleansing for Body and Hair, Gentle on Eyes. This is Baby Wash and this is Baby Shampoo. Why is it not an all-in-one like that Kids Essentials 3-in-1 back there by Arm & Hammer? Uh, let's pull that out. There it is. Watermelon Kiwi. Huh. Oh wow, that smells wonderful. I like that. Does it have an expire date on it? Does this stuff expire? Hmm. It doesn't seem to have an expire date, but I like the smell of that. Um, have have I seen this before? Lightweight hair gel from Dermasteel? Really? For sensitive scalps? No, I don't think I have seen that before, but I'm gonna grab me one. How about that? Oh, here's a EAD Clean Hair Gel. Huh. I've not seen that here. There's a couple of them, at least. And I think they're in the wrong place, so there's probably more lurking. But that's cool. So I was looking down here in the small bins, and we have Crabtree and Elvelin London Conditioner. Now, if I could find the soap, the shampoo to go with that, that'd be really cool. But that's the conditioner. That's kind of awesome. And up here is, I found a uh, body wash, Crabtree and Evelyn. So there might be more of this around. Huh. Okay, I found something I've been looking for and couldn't find. It is the Arm & Hammer Tout Free Foot Powder in 5 ounces. I couldn't find that at the other Dollar Tree, so I'm really excited to find it here now. I'm going to grab me one. Okay, I'm um, finding fashion jewelry, which I don't always do. Look at this pretty little clip for your hair with all the little pearls on it. But we have some earrings here. Oh, wow. Check those out. They're like the turquoise. Not turquoise. What am I trying to say? Uh, tortoise. <laughs> I said turquoise, and I meant tortoise in different shapes. But they're all the kind of tortoise color. The pearls on it too that's another clip but they have quite a few which i'm not used to seeing so awesome they brought the zen candles back out these are great i like the namaste ones a little bit better but there there's a great now hold the phone we have mike and ike wax melts yep red rages i had no idea that such a thing existed that is crazy yeah so look at these plates wow that's a very heavy bowl for a doll 25 nice and blue i love that it's a very uh, medium color blue and they have a darker one similarly right and they got all the pieces the bowls the big plates the little plates and the cups and then they even have the larger like mug type cups for it that would match either set awesome Oh wow, look at these bowls. I have not seen this with all the flowers. Or have I? It seems familiar though, doesn't it? But look how pretty. $1.25 a piece. And they have the little plates to match. That's got a pansy on it. Oh. And they have the bigger plates. Be careful, Regina. 
No, these are just these. But how stinking cute. Oh, wait, here they are. I'm in right in front of my face. Look at that with the butterflies. $1.25. I'm having to decide. It's got that pansy on it. I have to get at least one because of that pansy. I mean, I know. I know. I'm a little weird, but that's okay. All right, we're seeing more cups. Let's see what the ones that have the sayings on them. I still see the lemon squeezy cup. Enjoy the little things. This is my happy place with the garden theme. Every day is a fresh start. We have the plain ones that you can decorate however you would like. Look at these blue ones that would match the blue plates down there. Oh, what are these? Wow, these are heavy duty plates right here. Hang on a second. So they also sell these ceramic stickers and they sell ones that will go on glass as well. So and these are iron-on transfers over here. But first coffee. I've seen people DIY girl power these to death. There's flamingo, a couple of different ones. I'm gonna have to try to do some DIYs. Oh look at that. Earth every day, save the earth. What's the pink one I saw? girl power and you're my sunshine follow your bliss don't stop until you're proud love that love that and we've got the shatter free uh, wine holder you could put other things in that I think if you want it they're stackable shatter free yeah they are stackable look at that nice Ooh, we have uh, some new zero sugar dole strawberry pineapple drink mixes. I've not seen that. Here's Snapple. I think that's an old standard. Here's some different samples. There's some Crush. Let's see. Wow, we got a whole giant row. There's the Welch's. Here's more dole. Tropical Splash. The Energy ones. Here's some more dole. This one's peach mango trying to see what flavors they might have them. That's Welch's Strawberry Peach. Um, we'll sit here and organize their stuff if I'm not careful. So I'll kick. There's nothing wrong with straightening. It's just, you know, it'll take a long time. Crushed pineapple, excuse me, and these are all, all zero. And there's the strawberry pineapple again. Wow, okay. Have I seen the Talenti Gelato here before for five bucks? I don't know, but we got the Briars. They got Ben and Jerry's in the bigger containers now. Well, uh, and they got more pizzas. These are five, but then the Tony's is four, right? French bread up there for four. Um, here's the three. Not super stocked today, but they probably just hadn't gotten their truck. And then they still have their dollar twenty-five items, of course. Um, yeah. So up here are my um, my O snaps again. These are the sassy bites. I'm gonna grab me a couple of bags of those. I have a snack on the drive home. And here's the cheese again. And yeah, it's amazing to see that here. Now, one of the things I will say is I've seen people post online that they've had certain items that they bought from Dollar Tree that I've never seen at Dollar Tree. So if you're not seeing them actually purchase it or at the store while they're at the store, you might want to question it. I'm not saying anything bad about anybody, but, you know, we all got to use our common sense. And at this store, we do have bread items, which I don't always see. And what is this one? I don't see this one. Ellie's Ellie's dinner rolls and they're still a um, dollar 25 including their corn status in that nice large container um, yeah I'm not seeing a lot of price changes at this store um, I don't know what's going on everywhere but at this one I'm not seeing a ton, ton of price changes I don't see anything um, that much oh check this out this is a two for deal dollar 25 you get a pops and a Fruit Loops for $1.25. That is quite interesting, now, isn't it? Have we always had imitation crab meat here from Chick of the Sea? Maybe. Um, yeah. Well, we've seen the beef crumbles and then all this other tuna, but crab meat I think is a little different. 
Now I just want to mention that not all the Easter filler stuff is in the Easter section. This is an end cap way at the end of the store. So you might want to walk around and take a look. You might find some more stuff that you might want to use for your Easter baskets. So I found this extremely narrow fridge storage bin. And I, I like it. I'm not sure what I'm going to use that for, but I'm going to grab one because it is so narrow. And we always have those little places that we can't put things. And there's something in the back of my head saying I need to grab another one. I mean, wouldn't that work for a bathroom, closet? Yeah, that would work for all kind of areas. I'm going to grab two. Okay, the same as the other stores. There are drinks up front that they keep in the cooler and their snacks are the snacks are 250 now they have funyuns i love me some funyuns uh, but they are 269 so keep that in mind that they are not a dollar 25 like we're used to seeing um the red bull we have ruffles and cheetos and here's the coffee drinks and the uh, tea they have gold peak and sweet pure leaf now and oh doritos but they are not a dollar 25. Let's see, we got over here Gatorade and vitamin water. Yep, body armor flash for is 250. All right. Well, we have came, we have shopped, and the line is filling up, so that means it's my time to go because that's a dollar tree first. When one person gets in line, we all get in line. So anyway, thank you for coming with me on this shop with me to Dollar Tree. I hope you're having a great weekend. Um, take care and watch one of my other videos. Feel free to subscribe, share, give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment, ask a question. I'd love to hear from you. Anyway, take care and uh, happy shopping, folks. Bye.